In today's video, we're going to go over how you can be AI detecting software. And I want to preface this by saying you don't need to be AI detecting software for Google, but people keep asking, so I'm going to make a video on it. So let's jump straight in. Here is ChatGPT. I'm sure you've heard of it. And I'm just going to pick one of the things on the homepage. So I'm going to go with write an email. And this is going to write a really fun and exciting email for us. And I'm just going to take it from here. And I'm going to put this in the copy leaks AI detector. And I want to stress that this will detect most things as AI, whether it's AI or not. It just loves detecting AI. 83.6% chance of being AI. And now I'm going to come over to Quillbot. In Quillbot, we can just paste this in and we will paraphrase it. You can uh, sort of see behind me, but this is just going to start changing what's on screen. Uh, we've got the ability to like click random words and change them to something different. So instead of I hope for this email finds you in good health, let's change it to that this message finds you in good health. Like it's up to you. You can change stuff. You don't have to change stuff. And I'm going to copy this, put it back in this mega AI detector, and I'm going to check it. Reach my daily limit just to spite me. Give me two seconds. Let me just get it back in my copy buffer. I've still reached my daily limit. How annoying is that? Let's find another random AI content detector. There's a million of them and they're all terrible and you can ignore them all completely. But just to make people happy, let's use the writer one, shall we? Analyze that text. There we go. It's now 99% human generated. So it's that easy to beat the copy detectors. And again, I want to stress, don't worry about the copy detectors. They are there solely, solely as a way for the copy detector company to make money. If you look on Google, in fact, let's do it. Let's just jump straight back in. What is Google's stance on AI content? And we can come straight in like the top result. Google for developers, Google search content, Google searches guidance about AI generated content. I can talk at Google. We've long believed in the power of AI to transform the ability to deliver helpful information in this post. We'll share more about how AI generated content fits into our longstanding approach to show helpful content to people on search, rewarding high quality content. However, it's produced. They don't care. Like they're, they're more than happy to have AI content. I've got many a website that's ranking with AI content and I just wanted to put this out there like you're more than welcome to search it like type it in your keyboard look on the website it's developers.google.com you can't get any more official than the official Google website and what can I say myself and many other people are ranking with AI detectable content I'm ranking with AI undetectable content but it doesn't matter. It's pointless. The, the main thing you need to do is have high quality content, like good content, not just a bunch of crap words. There's many sites that produce lots of text, but we're not after lots of text. We're after high quality, relevant content that will keep our audience engaged and happy and overall make them come back to our website. Anyway, that's it for today's video and I will catch you later on.